you know, when you're playing like this on the snare, you can just change the sound just by pressing down on the head or playing more to the rim, to mm -hmm. more or less to get that timbali type, you know? Mm -hmm. If you just... So when you when you had the left hand in with that, you know. So you get all these different sounds off the snare. Yeah. Just right there, you know, just by choking the snare, you know, maybe put a little apply the pressure right. in the center of the head or back, you know, toward me mm -hmm. or forward. You know, mm -hmm. it's all it's a, it's a lot of sounds you can get out of a drum, period. Let's talk about your work with Dr. John. You Mac play, Rebenac, huh? Uh-huh. <laughs> you played on a great record called Tango Palace. Mm -hmm. Can you talk about uh, the type of feels that he wanted you to play? He brought me in to do just the New Orleans stuff. Mm -hmm. Grooves, not more or less, not Mardi Gras beat, Beats rhythm, in just the feeling, you know, mm -hmm. because he had stuff with, with, with a lope in it. You know, when you have that lope, you need a drummer that understands the lope Kay. part of the New Orleans groove, you know, when it comes down to... Uh, to playing, so, uh, uh, what was this one, like this renegade thing, man, you know, which is my favorite on the whole album. Mm -hmm. you know? He asked me to come up with something jungleish, you know, mm -hmm. jungle groovy, funky, but try not to use any hi hat. I said, hmm. Mm -hmm. I said, well, Mac, I'm gonna have to keep some kind of time. Well, I'm not talking about the time, I'm talking about playing on right. it. I said, oh, okay, all right. You know, so I started fooling around. The groove, I think the groove was. That's still a New Orleans type uh -huh. bass line. Uh -huh. You know, that's still a New Orleans right. thing. So uh, we took it there first, you know. And I was playing mostly on the snare drum. You know? That kind of thing, you know. Mm -hmm. Which is Taste of Pocky where was involved. Yeah. So then I started listening and listening and listening and said, wait, I got it. And I went. And it came together, man. Mm, mm. It came together real fine. What about a, you have a phrase called back it up. <laughs> <laughs> Can you demonstrate that? <laughs> back up funk. Back up funk. Well, it, all it is is just stopping the tempo when it, whenever I'm playing a funky lick. Right. And, uh, and maybe leave out a backbeat or put the backbeat anywhere. Okay. Just for one measure or so, you know, or one beat, you know. And uh, for instance, let me see, you know. You know, just uh -huh. throw the backbeat anywhere, but remember where you got to come back, you know. So, you right. know, uh, that's my trademark in town. A lot of cats, you know, they know me, they call me the backup drum. 